Hi guys, and welcome to your practice activity and challenge. It's a challenge because I'm showing you something, I'm showing you an animation, and I would like you to replicate it. It's a practice activity because you will get to apply everything you have learned in this section. Actually, there is nothing new here. Now it's time to practice. Now it's time to have your courage to create this animation. And it's very important that you do that. Because later on, we're going to start animating visual effects and uh, I know complex animations and playing with time and space. You need to practice to acquire the confidence that you can create any simple animation like this one. It's very easy, by the way. Let me give you a few tips here. For example, if you notice uh, just for the rectangle over here, the anchor point is just outside. Hence, you have this kind of scaling and moving, something like this. The rectangle over here also has its anchor point on the outside. It's only a matter of where to put your anchor point, how to scale, and how to position. It's so easy. In the next lecture, I provided you with a complete design. If you don't want to spend time designing, because the design here is very easy, and you can pick up this design and start animating and then sequencing. Please, guys, try your best to create this animation before you move on to the next section. Thank you. I will see you in the next lecture.